Spring cleaning could mean many things to Marion's homeowners. A light touch-up in the yard or porch, but for some properties, it takes a little more than that. The City of Marion partnered with the Grant County Affordable Housing Corporation for the Blight Elimination Project. As you can see, uh, it doesn't take very long for us to demo a house. Uh, this house here uh, will probably, within the next three days, all it will be is a, uh, a lot with uh, dirt on it. Marion received $1.2 million from Indiana's hardest hit fund, which has already demolished 70 blighted homes in the city. Well, when you uh, clean up dilapidated properties, you don't have all your drug uh, meth labs coming into town. You don't have all the rats that uh, abandoned the properties attract. Gary Massengale is the guy that gets to tear things down, but he says it's not destruction that makes the project worthwhile, it's new beginnings. One person starts cleaning up, it seems like the neighbor wants to clean up, and then that neighbor wants to clean up, so your whole block gets cleaned up. By getting rid of these old homes brick by brick, Marion has less room for rodents and drug usage, and more room for green space. Marion Building Commissioner Jerry Faustnight is excited to see the city improve. I feel sorry for individuals that have to live by homes that are falling down, that the property owners don't take care of, and we're wanting to make this just a better thing. So I guess my main thing is to make the city better. Spring cleaning may not be your favorite task, but when it helps the community, it's something everyone can look forward to. For Crossroads, I'm Brianna Gar.